Hey, what's up, folks? This is your boy Kato right here. Hey, check it out. I got my little grand dude with me here, right? And they kind of wanted to do me to do a video with them. So I was like, cool. You know what I'm saying? This is nothing new. I've always used to do video with my kids, even when my kids were little. We used to grab the camcorder and we would make up scenarios and scenes and stuff like that. Um, of course, they're all grown now and in their late 20s and early 30s, but... Um, now my grandkids, they kind of wanted to do something, so I said, ah, why not, and what not, so. And actually those old clips that I told you I used to do with my kids when they were little, I have them all on VHS. I might eventually um, convert them and put them, you know, on up here on the YouTube channel or something like that. I don't think they would mind all that stuff. It was a little fun stuff we used to do. So, um, creating scenarios and skits and stuff like that. But anyway, here's some stuff that uh, my two, uh, two of my grand dudes wanted to do. And I uh, said, all right, come on, let's do it. All right, hope you enjoy it. Peace. Hey, what's up, folks? This is Kato here. Hey, look here. Right quick, I just wanted to introduce you to a couple of folks right here. These are two of my little grand dudes. Um, this is my man, uh, Emmanuel, right here. We call him Manny. And right over here beside me, my man, Isaiah. You can call him Zay. What's up? What's up? They say, what's up? Hey, look here. It's something they always, I've always been doing, basically doing videos and stuff. And uh, Isaiah usually go online and he looks at the stuff and he asks today, you know, pop up. Can we do a video and all? I'm like, sure, why not do a video and talk about some of the things we talk about? Now, first thing I want to say about my little grand dudes here, these are the same dudes that I used as models for the uh, the, the children's book I released called um, I Want to Play Too. Um, if you can probably remember this, if you, if you haven't seen it, this is the book I Want to uh, Play Too, and I got Manny here, a modeling in it and uh, Isaiah Marvin. Actually, the book is actually based on uh, me and my cousin, this little kid, my cousin Byron, B.J. Jackson, who just recently passed away. So Isaiah here actually um, modeled as Byron for me and uh, Manny modeled as me, as we as little kids. If you haven't read the book, check it out. You can pick it up on Amazon. It, say what? La Parker. Yeah, yeah, okay, they, they're watching uh, Civil War. This one is something else, believe me. He try, I'm sure he's trying to run this thing, you know what I'm saying? This is a guy who can't even tie a shoe yet, but he's trying to run everything. That's, you know, that's how it is with the youngest. Anyway, my man Isaiah here, first of all, wanted to say congratulations to him because he just recently at his school uh, won basically sergeant at arms position, right? Yeah. So tell me a little bit about that position you want. What is it you do? Okay, um, well, I, um, I tell the people that's at the meetings um, what we're going to talk about or what we're going to do mm -hmm. next. And also, I keep everyone calm right. and yeah. focused. So, <clears throat> so basically, you just run things. Yeah. I basically just run things. All right. Well, congratulations on that kind of stuff. And um, actually, Isaiah here, you know, like I said, I've always been doing video clips, even you know, with their with their mom when they were kids and all, and my other kids when they were real little. And um, we did one actually with my youngest daughter Dominique and Isaiah called. What was that called? The video we did. The kindergarten skit with it. Detention. Kindergarten detention. And that was a little funny skit, you know what I'm saying? You kinda did your little eight debut acting. How old were you? I was like three or four. About three or four. Um if you haven't seen that wild video, I'll put that up a link up there, you can check that out. But that's he was real little, but he was funny. We used to get a kick out of him because back then we couldn't understand the kind of stuff. He would be talking and we couldn't understand what he'd be saying. So, you know how that goes. At any rate, you said you had a couple of questions too, right? Yeah. What's the, what question do you have? Okay, the first question is, um, why did you start making videos? Why did I start making videos? Yeah. Um, well, basically, this is something, like I said before, 
that I've always used to do, even when we had cam recorders. You know, before you were born, when your mom and her sisters and brother were little kids, um, we used to I used to take the camcorder and we would make videos and little 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 skits and stuff for kids. I would probably have them reading books and stuff. And um, so I've always been doing that kind of stuff just as a creative outlet. Then YouTube came about and it, it allowed you to share your creative outlet. So that's basically how I started doing it. I'm always trying to do something creative and being busy about it. So that's what I did. Cool. Yeah. Anything else? And my second question is, um, did you see people um, doing these things that you are doing now? Um, yeah, well, everything is inspired by something. You know, um, I try to keep myself busy. If he don't stop, this dude. I try to keep myself busy. And uh, so people, I would watch other people do creative things, and it would inspire me. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not the first person who, or not the top person who do videos on, on YouTube. And there were um, many people. Actually, you know, back about, I guess, almost 10 years ago with the, the YouTube thing, um, there were people who would be do, creating video content and sharing it and um, kind of um, networking with other people. Like there used to, there was a guy one time named Mr. I think he called himself Mr. Nice Guy. So he would create videos or he would create scenarios that would include people to incorporate that kind of stuff. So we did some projects like that together. And, you know, to make a long story short, everything is inspired by something that people do. So, especially when it comes to being creative, you know. So yeah, there are people that I've watched and I were inspired by, not copied off, but inspired by to create my own lane. And that's how you should do it whenever you want to do it. No. You thinking about doing uh, videos and stuff on YouTube? Yeah. You seem to ask about it a lot lately. Is that the case? Yeah. All right, what about this little dude? He's still watching Spider-Man on the screen. And everybody know I mess with Spider-Man. Mm -hmm. All right, anything else? Um, not right now. Not right now? Okay. Boom. Just tuning out. Once again, you can check him out on a video we did several years ago. Um, Matt, wait a minute. First of all, before we end, I want to say you got a birthday coming up, right? Yeah. Okay. And you'll be how old? 11. 11 years old. You'll be 11 years old on the 15th of March. So, we celebrating that while he's still getting his kicks off of Captain Marvel, that's Captain. I mean Captain America, Civil War. All right. First so, Iron Man. And what? First as Iron Man. Now you want to hear something funny? What is this about, Manny? This is reading about superheroes that fight. Look in the camera, and say what is it about? Superheroes is fighting. Superheroes <laughs> is fighting. <laughs> Mostly, I'm not watching this movie. So. Okay. You never seen this movie before. Okay, well then we kind of interrupted him. See what I'm saying? Just do the song. At any rate, stay blessed, right? Yeah. Alright, say peace. Peace. Say that peaceful Jigsaw.